Oh, come out. I was thinking uh, last time I was working on this car, I had a cat. But uh, we had to leave her at the vet, who we paid to, um, to have her murdered. Very nice. I think maybe I should tidy up a bit. Nah. Even my anti-rust spray disapproves. Mm, it's all floppy. <laughs> oh. I forgot to take the prop shaft out. I do like a nice shaft. Oh! Ow. Oh! So this is what I have to contend with, all this under seal. Stuff like this is what's taken up most of my time. See all under here as well, it's really thick under seal. Someone really did shoot a thick layer of sticky goop all over it. I must admit I'm not a fan of having sticky goop shot everywhere. You can see down here, this is the Norwegian Traffic Control Authority thing. This is what, when they checked the, um, the car over and for some stupid reason passed it. This is where they uh, etched the chassis number, so um, to stop people just reshelling cars. Well, that'll have to be it today. I've got the other spring out and cleared a load of um, sticky, nasty goop off the underside. But like I said earlier, I had this wonderful idea that if I um, unbolted the dampers, the wishbone thingies at the bottom, and the bolts that hold on the suspension, I thought I could pull all of the front stuff away in one. But turns out not to be because, like I said, the bushing on that lower wishbone is all mangled and trapped and I can't really get to it until I get the engine out. Which I can't do until I get the bonnet off. Which I can't do on my own.